If you're looking for a one-of-a-kind activity to do with your family this summer, you won't want to miss the Desert of Maine here in Freeport. Yes, it's an actual desert. But the funny thing is, it wasn't always here. Well, actually, this used to be very fertile farmland uh, back in the 1700s. Uh, Tuttle's actually bought it. Actually, he bought it without telling his wife. And he came back and said, honey, guess what I bought? And, of course, she went a little bit of shock. And uh, after a little bit of argument, she said, well, if I'm going to live out here, you need to bring my barn and my house. They lived in South Portland at the time. So by oxen, they brought it over here. It was amazing what they could do back then uh, and actually built the farm. Um, it was actually productive farmland for several years. And then between the clear cutting, bringing sheep in, uh, not rotating the, st uh, the crops proper, um, sand all of a sudden started appearing. They didn't know what it was at that time. So as time went on, the, the sand kept appearing more of what it really was doing with the topsoil was eroding. And uh, after several years of that, um, actually it turned into the, the glacier desert that was underneath it all along that people didn't know was here. And so from there, it just kind of spread almost three to 500 acres. And now it's really shifting quite a bit because the wind uh, still moves it around quite a bit. Well, there's several reasons to come and uh, visit the Desert of Maine. It's got about everything you can think of, especially family-oriented. It's got educational purposes behind it, geology. Uh, if you're studying that part of it, uh, there's a lot out here. Um, and we do a lot for, for the entertainment with kids. Um, we, ha we include a 30-minute narrated tram ride that takes you around the desert, basically takes you around the perimeter. It shows you and tells you and explains to you the history and the geology part of it. So uh, there is a lot of history out here. It also takes you into the wooded area where you get to see nature slowly taken back and reclaiming the desert. Uh, we also have the barn that uh, was built in 1783 with a lot of uh, barn equipment in it, antiques that kids really had never seen before or understand how they work. So we also offer the barn as a, as a part of the tour. Uh, for kids under 12, we also seed an area for little gemstones that they can come out and, and have a little fun playing in the sand and uh, as a reward they get to keep three of the gemstones they find. Um, so it's got a little bit of everything. Uh, we also have the gift, stop, uh, gift shop. We also have the campground that's, uh, that we keep very family oriented. And um, you know, of course it's very picturesque. It's the only place like it in the state the Desert of Maine up here in Freeport. Take exit 20 off 295 and drive west on Desert Road right to the end. You can't miss it. We'll be right back.